YouTube. What's going on? Willie P coming back with another one. Let's get it. We up at the football field. We back at the gridiron. We're going to talk some ball. AFC quarterbacks, pressure to perform. Yeah, some pressure on these guys for various reasons, for different reasons. Seen the thumbnail? You seen the thumbnail? Some pressure on these guys. Josh Allen, Deshaun Watson, Lamar Jackson, Russell Wilson. Yeah, some pressure on these guys. Pressure to perform this upcoming season, 2023-2024 season. So we're going to talk some ball. We had the gridiron. You know, I got to call my ball talk. You know, it's been a, been a week or so. So back on the gridiron, we're going to talk some ball. Like in, you know, I ain't fumbling the rock. Like in, before I start the video, please watch the entire video. Like, come to the channel, so more content. Like, this is content about sports and various topics. Let's get it. Yeah, pressure to perform. And like I said, all these guys, they have pressure on them to perform for different reasons. Let's start with Josh Allen. Why does Josh Allen have pressure on himself to perform this year? All the hype is always on Josh Allen to get over the hump to overcome Patrick Mahomes. Every year, the Bills have the hype. But they end up either falling to the Chiefs or they get upset by another team. They can't get to the big dance. Josh Allen has to get over that hump this season. Yes. His statistics are great. You know, always have great numbers. You know, 35 touchdowns, 14 interceptions, about seven rushing touchdowns. So his statistics are great. He has to start taking care of the ball, though. I will say that. Josh Allen has to start taking care of the ball. You know, he started turning the ball over a lot late in the season for Buffalo. But, yeah, he has to get over that hump. Can he overcome Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs? Can the Bills? So, pressure to perform for Josh Allen to get over that hump. That's why I threw him on this list, pressure to perform. Coming in at number one. Coming in at number two, pressure to perform, Deshaun Watson. Yes, Deshaun Watson, he has to get back to form. Missed the entire season with Houston, forced to trade. Now he's in Cleveland, only played six games after the suspension. Seven touchdowns, five interceptions, one rushing touchdown. Timing was off. You know, accuracy wasn't there. So he has to get back to form, Deshaun Watson. He's going to have some weapons. David Njoku, Mari Cooper. Mari Cooper had a great year. Had a great year with Jacoby Brissett. Pro Bowl season, Amari Cooper. Then you just acquired Elijah Moore from the Jets. Speedy guy, quick guy, fast guy. You got the run game with Nick Chubb. So it's pressure on Deshaun Watson to perform this season for the 2023-2024 season. Pressure on Deshaun Watson. He has the weapons. Cleveland has the roster. So we'll see what he could do. Pressure on Deshaun Watson to perform. Coming in at number two. Coming in at number three. Lamar Jackson. He has to figure out his deal, figure out his team, but he has to get back to himself, get healthy. Lamar Jackson only played in 12 games last season. You know, ended with another injury. But he has to get healthy and show he's still top five. Show I'm still top five quarterback. They've been disrespecting Lamar. You know, don't have a deal right now. Can't work out a deal with Baltimore, so they've been throwing dirt on his name. Saying he's not worth it. He's not worth the contract. He's not worth this. He's not worth that. So Lamar Jackson has to get back to form. Has to get back to form. 17 touchdowns, seven interceptions this past season. So Lamar Jackson, he has to get back to form. And I'm looking forward to Lamar Jackson. Lamar the star, getting back to form. Got to get healthy. Got to get healthy. Got to stay healthy. So Lamar Jackson coming in number three on this list. AFC quarterbacks. These are all AFC quarterbacks, baby. So coming to number four, Russell Wilson. Yeah, Russell Wilson got a bounce back. 16 touchdowns, 11 interceptions. Just didn't look like himself with Denver. But I'm sure Sean Payton, he'll fix that. You know, now the mile high, he'll fix that. Offensive guru, Sean Payton. So Russell Wilson, 16 touchdowns, 11 picks. Like I said, didn't look like himself all season. Got some weapons, you know, big big receiver in Cortland Sutton. 
you know, tall receiver. Got Jerry Judy. Got a few weapons, so it's on Russ to get it together. You know, bounce back this season. Got to be a bounce back year for Russell Wilson. AFC quarterbacks. Yeah. These guys, like I say, pressure to perform for various reasons, for different reasons. Like I said, Josh Allen, he has to get over that hump. All the hype, everybody give him the love, but he has it produced on the field when it really matters. You know, Deshaun Watson has to get back to form. Missed an entire season, only played six games after the suspension with Cleveland. Has to get back to form. Lamar Jackson has to get healthy, find a team. Hopefully him and Baltimore can figure something out. Russ Wilson, you know, Denver had a terrible season. Timing was off, just didn't look like himself at all. But Sean Payton, offensive guru, he's back in the league now, coaching Denver, so I'm sure he'll fix that. Offensive guru, so like I said, pressure to perform this season. We're at the field, you know, I ain't following the rock. He's back on the gridiron, so keep the ball talk coming. You know, I ain't gonna stop. Let me know what y'all think. I'm going to keep it coming. We out here. Still football weather. Spring. So, I love it, though. We out here. Let me know what y'all think. I ain't going to stop. I ain't following the rock either. Knock another one out. Bop, bop, bop. Let's get it.